Hi, it's Kim, you're loved, and I am excited. Uh, I should be getting a package in the mail today. Well, not in the mail, from the ed FedEx guy who who tried to deliver it before, but I wasn't... You know, FedEx is a mess here in Finland, at least, if not elsewhere in Europe, for people who are not companies. Anyway, I should be getting my first... LGT lightsaber from FedEx delivered by FedEx today to Europe, to Finland and we'll see how that goes because uh, most of the videos I've seen are from Americans where there's Crimson Dawn and there's all these companies but straight from LGT store on AliExpress we'll see Little did he know we wouldn't see for another three days So that was three days ago. I waited the whole day for the package. It didn't arrive. And then there was a weekend, so nothing happened then. And also, 1st of May celebrations here. Not the smoothest experience with FedEx. And my excitement has worn off a little bit. But today, I went and fetched the package from their warehouse myself. So now I have the package. Luckily, they didn't throw it away until then. Now, the person answering my emails, they were very nice and professional. I've no complaint about them. And the people at the warehouse, I, I gave them the numbers and they brought me the package. So it all went well after that. But the calling service and and just the all-around confusion with FedEx, I would suggest if they try to deliver it and... Uh, you're not home to receive it then to go and get it from them because that seems to be the easiest they promised me they would call me and then deliver it Friday th three days ago and they didn't call or deliver it so I don't know what that's about but a little janky on the FedEx side but I have the package I've removed all incriminating evidence so you shouldn't be able to find where I live, but like it's in this custom Sabres box, and I, and I'm ex, I'm excited. When I started thinking of getting a lightsaber, I started researching for places in Europe where you could get one. Well, first I looked at Crimson Dawn and everything that the American videos and suggestions show. You can buy lightsabers from them to Europe as well, but the delivery is like, I don't know, 60 euro, I think, when the lightsaber mystery box would have been like less than a hundred euros. So then like half of it, a third of the whole price being delivery, I, I didn't like that prospect. Then I searched up that some of them are LGT resellers and some of them are sort of modifiers and whatnot. So then I thought that I would just get it straight from LGT. So then I I've ordered other stuff from AliExpress before, but I didn't realize they had like dedicated stores to lightsabers. And I, yeah, LGT store, not the LGT saber store or whatever the other one is. I, I, they don't seem to have a lot of differences except I think LGT store prices were a little lower and I don't know why. So then I looked at the models. Got one that I seem to like, then a few other parts to be able to customize it. Now, okay, things seem to have fallen out of their containers, so here's the hilt. It feels very good. It feels very solid, and it is very thin. Uh, it has the saber staff attachment, but I got another pommel. Uh, black pommel. Thought it would be nice to have it sort of as a black and gold. This is a very nice hilt. The emitter also seems cool. Then, so this is not a neopixel blade. This is just a a normal blade with a 
Nice tip there. And some info. So these don't have, I think LGT store sabers might come with a sort of little wallet with all these cards and stuff. Ah. Uh. Focus. Rebellion and Empire branded cards that have instructions on them. So I will comply with the directions and charge it before turning it on. But I just want to take a look at these other parts. Uh, these all uh, were separate parts that cost a little more. A pommel for focus. Fauk sim single saber use when I don't want to use it as a staff saber. A blade plug. Also focus. Focus. How do... Also separately bought. Then some uh, wrapping material. I don't know if it would have been wiser to get some from a sports store or something, but I got it from there. And then, well, I think... I think I can't change the emitter for this, but I do have this black uh, emitter also that I bought separately. So yes, I will get to charging this up and when it's charged I'll I'll do a little excitement review of it. Let's see. Actually before I go I will uh tell what all of these cost. So the hilt and this blade uh, was 55 euros very nice with eco smooth swing so on the Ali on the um, LGT store it's called lead 9 sound 2 at least with this saber then the plate plug 16 euros it looks nice I like the look of that but but spiral of death. The handle wrap was eight and a half euros. The pommel, fifteen. There are different designs for almost all of these that cost a little uh, varying amounts. Then the emitter was seventeen and a half euros, approximately. Doesn't seem to me a bad price for well at least what it seems you get but i'll actually see if i get what i what other people have got from this see you soon okay it's charged i i had stuff to do so this is a different day but now now it is the time it's good that these are wrapped well, because it tests the Jedi or the Sith's patience. Patience. Let's see, so... You go into here. Ooh. Then we have the screws. Retention screws that hopefully will screw into place okay that screws in and the other one that feels pretty secure okay but now for the moments of truth i'll actually close this because there's light coming in from there but i will say it's pretty bright today so if it doesn't look spectacularly bright it's it's pretty much daylight now. Let's listen. Oh. We have music at three points. Okay. But Okay. 
That's cool. Yes. You know, it's day and everything. But like, even so, I do like the smooth swing, compared to any other sabers I might have had earlier. It's, it's very nice. Yes. Soft sound. Soft sound. sound. I don't know how well the sound is coming through, but it's it's pretty loud even on soft sound. So press Blinking twice, you can let it cycle through colors, and when it's something you like, um, pressing the button will stop it there. I could do a whole different video about the features. Yeah, so this is not a Neo Pixel blade, so this doesn't have LEDs all the way through the blade. It just has LEDs in the bottom there, but it's it's still pretty nice. I like it. I'm just a big kid now. You give me this, I'm... I'm gone. Oh, that was fun. It's, I have it charging again here because I used it for quite some time. But the verdict would seem to be that if you want to buy a lightsaber in Europe, uh, an entry-level lightsaber like this, uh, with eco smooth swing and whatnot, the best ba place to do it would be uh, straight from LGT store or LGT saber store on AliExpress. Because I didn't find any, any Crimson Dawn-like stores in Europe at least when I try to look for them and then delivering from America to here is, is so much more expensive so I'll leave a link to LGT store 
uh, where I bought that and also probably LGT Saber store, which is, I think it's the same company, but a different store for, I don't know what reason. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, I will happily answer them in the comments and you are loved. Let's spread some love today.